You know, in celebration of Black History Month, all month long, we're inviting local black-owned businesses here on the show. And today, we're going to get more than a little elegant. Wait until you see this. Oh, yes, we are, because we have Sandra <laughs> Falk here. She's an amazing designer. She's the CEO and owner of Fashion Design and Apparel Manufacturing right here in Las Vegas. Sandra, where did you discover your talent, your, talent, your passion uh, for design and sewing? When I was about nine, wow. I could just look at something and I would go home and I would just try to make it. Mm, just yeah. from scratch? Just from scratch, paper, Amazing. you know, sheets, whatever I could find. Mm -hmm. wow. And um, I just fell in love with just sewing. It's like a puzzle to me. I could just see it, put all the pieces together and come up with something really cool. And then mm. I took sewing in high school. Um, but the funnest part of, of that area of my life was when my, I asked my mother for a sewing machine. Um, we really couldn't afford to buy one, so we went to a garage sale, and I had she bought me a Singer. It was ten dollars. Oh, <laughs> I still have it. I used it all through college. Wow. They're yeah. reliable. It's the best singers. machine ever. Yes. I mm -hmm. am anxious to see to hear about these these beautiful designs you've brought here with us with these fabulous models. You've got some unique vision for fashion. Mm. You know, my mother always told me that I you know, walk to my own beat. Mm -hmm. and, um, I never liked having the same kind of clothes or looking like anybody else. I wanted something unique, something different. And um, I, I, I like to go and look at what I call them, ugly fabrics. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because if they're unusual, people aren't going to buy them. But you could, I see beauty in them. And you can take those mm. and mix and match and come up with something really, really outstanding. You have vision. Yes. I'm inspired by you. Can you take us through each one? By the way, ladies, you're beautiful. And thank you for Absolutely. being here. So this dress is... Um, an inspired, my inspired version of an African wedding gown. Mm. Um, I was asked by um, the Bridal Spectacular if I could just design something for a photo shoot that they had and the area was all about Africa. Mm -hmm. So um, I was like, wow, this is great. So first I had to find the fabric. So I researched fabrics. This fabric is Zambian. It comes from Africa. Mm. Wow. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. There's 20 yards of fabric in here. Um, mm -hmm. And so I wanted to give it a Sandra Fall Couture pop, and I love sparkle yeah. and elegance. And so I added the sheer tool that goes over it so it illuminates and it sparkles underneath the lights. The collar is all glass beads, and each one is sewn on by hand. Wow. Unbelievable. Yes, and so I studied, um, tried to um, find the right type of headwear. Mm -hmm. and. I just came up with this one, and I, I like that it has feathers on it. Mm -hmm. And you mentioned Sandra Falk Couture. This is a true example of it, too. Yes, thank you. So um, I love Paris and French, and, you know, the French are like, va, 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 vie, or whatever. <laughs> and I wanted to just give a new take on a um, jacket, so I did it all in lace. It's very, very sheer, which is very now, very in. The front of it is covered, so you really can't see anything, but you can see anything. Ooh, mm -hmm. um, just enough. Yes. Suggestion is there. Beautiful. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> and then the last one we did for um, an event, and I was actually inspired by the uh. fabric first. Um, it's yes. all hand painted. There isn't any more of it. I'm the only one that has it, by the way. Wow. So if you want, you have to come to me to get it. And then um, I just like to play with feathers and crystals and <gasps> draping, and that's what I came up with. So. How did the business part of this start for you? Well, um, I started my career uh, designing uniforms actually here in Vegas. For no. Me. Yes, hotels, yeah. casinos, you know. It was a lot of fun, but me as a designer, you get tired of you know, 6535 poly cotton, and I wanted to find the more ornate, refined kind of fabrics. And mm -hmm. I did a, a wedding gown for one of my clients, the, the very first one, and I was hooked ever since mm. then. Wow. Sandra, we want to make sure that people can connect with you. I'm, I'm coming here, I'm just about jumping out of my skin because I want you to build me a dress so badly. <laughs> you <laughs> actually do this for people. Where are you located? How can people connect with you? We are located at Cheyenne and Buffalo in the Cheyenne Fountains um, Shopping Center. It's 7450 West Cheyenne, Suite 112. Mm -hmm. We're open Monday through Friday, 10 to 6. And um, we love what we do. We would love for you to just... Fantastic. Do you dress men? Two? Well, let's just say I dressed two men in my life. One was my husband, the other <laughs> one was Kenny Loggins. So, <laughs> it's not bad. Yeah, nice. That's it. <laughs> that works. That's, those are the only two guys I can dress for. But. I love it. <laughs> but listen, to stand next to one of 
these beautiful ladies in one of your gorgeous gowns oh. makes us look very, very good. <laughs> <laughs> you does. guys are too kind. Oh. Yeah, absolutely. Well, if you would like to discover the talents of Sandra Falk, her website is right there on your screen. Sandra Falk Couture, right here in Las Vegas. She started out on a Singer sewing machine in Chicago as a kid, and now she has a this. thriving business. This Look is something this. else. Yeah. And uh, by the way, you can also check her out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Don't miss it. <laughs>